A growing number of farmers and conservation experts are focusing on soil health to reduce costs, help the environment, and increase yields. The U.S. Department of Agriculture's Natural Resources Conservation Service is working with farmers to maximize their soil's performance. By building our soils now will allow us the, the competitive edge that may mean the difference between survival and, and not surviving later on. De Sutter is using no-till planting and cover crops to increase soil nutrients and prevent runoff. The more of these things we do, the more of these practices we adopt, the better our soil gets and the healthier it gets and the more active it becomes. When you're seeing yields start to go up and climb and, and, and do things that other people said were impossible. NRCS's Ray Archuleta advises farmers on three basic actions to improve soil health. They can understand their context by digging a little into the soil, understand that their soil is a living biological system. The second one is that they can learn to um, disturb less, less physical disturbance. And the third one is they need to learn to use more diverse living covers, more cover crops. Farmer Rodney Rulon says soil health conservation practices have lowered his costs, making for a better bottom line. Our total nutrient use ha has consistently gone down uh, to get the same yields or even improved yields. Uh, just the cycling and the biology and everything that's going on there has really helped to um, kind of pull that nutrient cycle together and make it a little more efficient. Farmers can contact their local NRCS office for more information. For the U.S. Department of Agriculture, I'm Bob Ellison.